My full name is Domenico Daniel Giovinazzo, but I'm known as Daniel. I'm 19 years old. The first time I played guitar on a stage, I was six years old, and then I decided to take it seriously at the age of 13. I'm a guitarist first, definitely, but I also like to use my ear. I like writing and composing and helping other people write. I think writing is going to become bigger with me as I go along. Great picture. If I were gay, I would give you my soul. If I were gay, I would give you my whole being. If I were gay, we would pretend I'm a boss. But I'm not gay, so won't you stop cupping my balls? Pants, this is a family show. You can't say that in a family show. But thank you for participating. I really like directing a lot. Um, it's stressful at times, obviously, with anything, but um, it's really, it's really rewarding to see people like getting grasping the the concept that you are giving them like, um, which this. way is uptown okay where okay hey <laughs> no it's um when it's on her uh, it's, it's the end hey, of her hey, hey. Would, okay. it's at the end of her hey I actually wrote that down in my machine music. I forgot to tell you. I'm sorry. Okay. But I'm like, wait, where is it? Oh, okay. It's right after her hay. Yeah. Cabin's on Kylie's hay. Yeah. So they're See? Good. <laughs> 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 oh, my God. I have written down. So. <laughs> Rachel's pitch to me when she was talking about it. I could really, I really felt that she was passionate about it, and her goals um, of what she was working towards were really interesting and intriguing to me. And I wanted to do anything I could to help. Victimize my bitter, bitter <laughs> Rachel, 
and I have done shows before, and she contacted me letting me know that, about the show, and that's how I got involved. I was roped into it by the director. She forced me and said that I owe her. It just, it sounded exciting, and I had already uh, performed in a couple cabarets, and I love doing it. I love just performing and getting out there, so, and I wanted to work with Rachel. I heard the legend Ra Ra Rachel, Rachel, Rachel Manconi um, was going to be directing it. So I thought to myself, all right, I've never worked with this person. We both have a lot of experience, and we're both really talented. So we thought that, you know, we could try and avoid the whole ego clashing and maybe do a show together. Rachel sent out a notice online, and I said I wanted to be in it. So, and plus I was singing with Rachel at piano, so she kind of mentioned it to me, and so I, you know, jumped on board. Rachel Manconi is my teacher, singing teacher, so I heard from her. Rachel is my vocal teacher, actually, and she offered the show to me because I'd bring my guitar over to play as I sang, and as soon as I heard that there was a possibility to play, I took it. Let's do it again, really fast. Oh, someone's... <gasps> <laughs> We're getting pizza. Good job. Alright, just so you know, Kylie is on stage right now. And I stole her phone because she's on stage. And I'm texting her, I'm texting Rachel from her phone saying, I have a crush on Danny. So, gotcha. Um, that's Danny's fantasy world that he likes to live in. I mean, it's a little weird doing a show with like three different ex girlfriends in the cast. No, Danny and I never dated. That's sad for him, though, because I'm a really good girlfriend. If I'm not here, at least my jewels are! that I try to break everything down because I'm, I'm a teacher too and um, so I try to explain myself very clearly and I try to uh, uh, collaborate with other people and make sure everybody, my performers, are very um, comfortable with what they're, their surroundings and the material that they're doing and and because I'm a performer also, that's what I like in the director. I love when directors actually play off of me and give me uh, feedback and all that stuff. So that's what I try to do. So I hope that I'm a good director. <laughs> the best director ever. No comment. Mm. <laughs> well, uh, she's great. I mean, she's Rachel. She brings a lot of excitement to rehearsal, which is great. She's a lot of fun. She's pretty organized, which is a good thing. Because she's a teacher, she can see where you your strengths and your weaknesses are, and she focuses on, on your strengths more than your weaknesses and how to make them shine. And not that she's hiding your you know your weaknesses or, at all, but she also explains things really well. And I like that. I like how how we can have a communication going back and forth. I think she's great. Um... I think she needs to stop flirting with me. She's so organized, she's so enthusiastic, she has everything under control, and she's a true professional. I really, really respect her and admire her, not only as a director, but as a singer and an actress. It's so fun to direct, uh, be with her as, as a director, and she's, she makes it so funny. First of all, she's a great teacher. I've had her for three months. My voice has changed phenomenally, and she's a great friend. And she's a great director because she made it personal. She made us want to do it for the good of everyone, not just like looking out for yourself. She's probably one of the better ones that I've worked with. She loves to see Chinese food, which is really good. <laughs>